All right guys, so today we got our 2019 Logan snowmobile trailer out here. Figured I'd take you around and show you a couple things on it. This is a 31 foot trailer. Um, this trailer has a bunch of uh, options on it. You got two batteries under here, spare tire, uh, electric over hydraulic jack, and the bigger propane tanks in it with the battery cutoff switch. This has the roll up door enclosure. Keeps the everything nice and enclosed and out of the way. Um, you got your little light right there for when you're hooking up in the evening. <clears throat> so this is the stone gray color on the outside. Um, you got your side load ramp there for your snowmobiles to offload off of. This trailer I put uh, 7K axles on and 14 ply tire and aluminum wheels. So you never have to worry about overloading it or popping tires. Um, this has got reverse lights hooked up to the side right there. So that light right there is actually reverse light. So when you put in reverse, it'll shine bright right there and you can see where you're backing up on the side. You got your side door. You got loading lights up top over each door. One there, two up there. All frameless windows on this trailer. A little sleeker look. Get a step there to get up in your side door. Digital combo locks on this thing. All push button digital combo locks. So smooth siding, no rivets or anything on the whole trailer. And we got the tread right, black tread right coming up right there on the whole side. So a little more resistant for hitting brush, stuff like that. Sheer rear door. Got the fold down piece here. Got reverse lights in the back again. And then along with the lights going up the side. Two more loading lights in the back. Same lights on the other side there. This trailer we kind of set up for four seasons. So it's uh, completely insulated with two heaters, then it has the air conditioner and the awning on it for summertime. Here's your frameless windows again. You got your reverse light on this side as well. And full electric awning on the outside. Another loading light above that door. And that is your 30 amp receptacle right there. Then all LED lights along the outside. All the running lights are all LEDs, the little dot LED lights. Take you in and show you the back here, or the inside. Those are torsion axles as well. So we did a bunch of little upgrades on the inside on this guy. So we got your fold down workbench right here. And then we put a 110 outlet right next to it. So if you guys want to set anything on it that needs to be plugged in or cooking, anything like that. Um, then you got your oil shelf up top, broom holder right there, fold down bench. We got two of those in this guy. So that's your fold down bench in the down position. And that's your one in the up position right there, all nice and out of the way. <clears throat> Uh, we opted for the bigger speakers in this trailer, so we got the bigger speakers all the way around, as well as a subwoofer on this side. This is fully insulated on the roof and walls and lined with a white aluminum skin. And you got your strap tie rack right there, so you hang your straps in between those two poles, tighten them back up so they're nice and neat and out of the way. Another 110 outlet there. And your oil tray right there. And then you got your shelving on this side. So you got two lockable boxes. These are all made by Logan as well. They're not prefab or anything. The shelf up there, that's your tire changer deal. So another box that has all the amp and stuff. Another 110 outlet inside there. Charge anything. 
Then this one has the touchscreen radio on it. That's your awning control there. And it's got USB ports and a 12 volt port there. <clears throat> That's your inverter control panel there. So this one has an inverter on it, so it'll power the heater and run the 110 heater off the batteries. And this guy got the track system all along the side, tying everything down with. No fender wheels on the inside. This sits completely above the fenders. Dovetail on the back. <clears throat> and that's your side ramp from the inside. This one we did a little bit different front on than most. It's got the Summit LQ package in it. So real basic LQ package. I got you the fold down dinette. All this will fold up and out of the way so you can park stuff there when you need with a window right above it. Then this has the microwave in it. And then all soft touch walls, LED lights up above. These LED lights are all touch on and off as well as to a switch. <clears throat> and then that's your big hot dog heater that will heat the whole trailer up very quickly. And then you have the little heater in for the cabinets. So that's one of your drying bins there. The small heater is ducked into this drying bin. So you can turn it on and heat that up as well as ducted in here to your boot dryer. So you dry everything out inside there. <clears throat> this one, we put another 110 outlet back here. Um, you got your fridge, propane or 110 fridge in there. It'll run either way. So when you're going down the road or on off propane, then we finish the inside up here with some nice cabinetry, all soft touch walls, darker cabinets, all the way around there. This cabinet here is set up for a TV you put on it. It's got the ports back there for the TV. And you got your big wardrobe right here set up for hanging or shelves, whatever you want to do. <clears throat> Maybe one last look around here. Oh, this trailer also has the vents up here, you got two of those, one right here, and then one all the way in the back back there. Those vents powered off these deals here. So they're reversible, you can set them to temperatures, all kinds of controls on those. And then you got your hook up here. You got one here and then one in the back as well. It's another one, we put an extra one of those. I think only one comes standard. This trailer's pretty loaded up compared to most. We got put his hooks about everywhere we possibly could. Got a whole row of hooks under here. Hang a lot of stuff up in here. Frameless windows all open up. And this trailer is a 2019, so it's been here for a little bit. We have it extremely discounted. So give us a call for price or any questions on it. We'll be happy to help you out. This trailer still sells with a brand new warranty. The warranty will start when it leaves the lot. So it's eight year structural warranty, two year hitch to bumper and limited lifetime on the steel frame of the trailer. So give us a call if you have any questions. Thanks.